Greetings, Janet here. Welcome to my channel. At this moment, I want to share what I have named Jessica's Corner. And let's get to it right now. Okay, we're going, here it is. Now see, Jessica got me this big dresser here. That's a music stand and a mic stand. And there's the Christmas tree that Pamela did. But uh, this here uh, dresser she got, and she asked me what was my favorite painting. And actually, the painting that uh, this was supposed to be copied sort of after is in the other room. It got a hole in it from sitting on the back of this door here. But uh, now, but what is Jessica's corner is right here. You see, she put up this. She was here looking through my stuff, and she left this up. And I love it. I think it looks so beautiful right next to... Uh, the dresser. They all go together. Plus, there's this cute little thing at the bottom that I totally do love. It's a round one. And it's... Uh, it's... What would you call it? Uh, water with those water lilies in it. Maybe water lilies. This is Jessica's corner. See? And this uh, dresser she got me did come in handy because it has a lot of my art supplies in it. And here's more of her corner. There's a portfolio full of paintings. So that would would be for Jessica. Maybe she could share the rights with Mariah because I guess it's sort of morbid of me to think about when I'm gone, but see, these all, the reason why, oh, they're not for sale, but this one might be. You might find this one here and fineartamerica.com under Janet Lyons, and you could get it on a t-shirt. Wouldn't that be pretty to wear it on a t-shirt? Or I wonder, a scarf or they have, or, or a coffee cup or a, or a tablet? fineartamerica.com and Punch in my name, Janet Lyons, and there'll be an option, I think, paintings. And you could also get this on your own canvas to put on the wall. Why not? Sometimes this stuff could, uh, these copies could come out better than the originals, possibly. So... Let's turn it around again. Hi, here I am again. So, yeah, I wanted to come in today because uh, I've been playing a lot of songs down and um, found an old... Uh, actually, I'm getting some book... Uh, some book tape in the mail so I could pick some of these old song books up and play some of these old tunes in them. Because uh, that's what I like to do, so I might as well do it. I like to paint too, but I haven't been doing it so much. I think I have enough, but and it, and it is a lot of work. It's all a lot of work. Everything's a lot of work. Even thinking about going on a vacation is a lot of work. Maybe eating is a lot of work. 
maybe complaining is a lot of work. I think that's what I do best, and it's something that's that uh, I say not to do it. That's why I try not talking too much because, uh, yeah, that's another thing about those uh, my nightmares and dreams. Gets me talking maybe too much or tells too much. But it, it is content matter, but maybe it's better to put out music and art than these strange dreams. There's, I think I counted up one time, there's 106 or so, I can't remember. And I'm, and I'm only put out 20. I don't know how many more. I actually will put out, oh, today is February 19th, 2024, and yesterday was mom's birthday. She would have been 100 years old. And uh, on this other blog when I was talking about my mom, I didn't get to tell you that, that she liked to jitterbug, and in her day, back in the day before she was married to dad, maybe she won a a jitterbug contest with some fellow and some dancing fellow and she got a box of candy and she opened it and everybody ate up all her candy. That was one of her stories. Yeah. She would have been a hundred years old today. She walked when they opened the Golden Gate Bridge, they let everybody walk across it and she might have been some kind of a teenager at that time walking across the Golden Gate Bridge. And so, yeah, had she lived, she would have been 100. Anyway, my daughter's asking me if I want French toast. Did you hear her? Or maybe she was asking uh, her son. I'm just hearing things. Okay, so, yeah. Uh, today is the 19th of February 2024 and it's the very first day of Pisces season so water sign and good things are coming for for water signs yeah I was hearing about it I, I, I like listening to the several different astrologers, a few of them. Anyway, enough ranching and raving and going on about nothing. Basically, okay, it's dead.